Hi, and welcome to Rock Talk, Round Rock ISD's roundtable discussions where we talk about the items that impact our parents. Joining me today on our panel to talk about food services and free and reduced lunch programs are Kelly Gronus, our Director of Food Services, and our Chief Operating Officer, Mr. Bob Servi. Thank you for joining us on Rock Talk. Our pleasure. Thank you for having us. So obviously, um, school lunches and school breakfasts are a huge component of what we do in school districts. I mean, it's not just about teaching and learning in the classrooms. Um, it's about feeding and, and Bob and your experiences, you know, also about making sure they get there and the facilities are looking really good. Um, Kelly, if you could just start off and give us um, a grand scope of how much food uh, we serve uh, as a school district. Um, well, as you know, there's 50 schools throughout the school district and so we serve breakfast and lunch at all of those schools. We also have an after school snack program and we serve dinner at some of our schools as well. Um, so all in all, that's close to 40,000 meals that we serve every day throughout our school district. And from an operation standpoint, Bob, what are the things that we need to, what are the things that the school district does to support food and breakfast? The biggest thing is we have the central kitchen where a lot of the preparation can be taken care of uh, in, in advance. It also helps plan out the, the calendars and touring the, the, being new to the district and in, tour, in touring the central kitchen, what, what fascinated me as much was, Tomorrow's is already taken care of as far as what's going to take place and how it is staged. So they're always one day ahead, which makes things flow a whole lot easier for both the schools and planning within the schools. A big program in school districts is the, uh, the free and reduced lunch program. Mm -hmm. Kelly, can you talk to uh, what that program is and how parents um, should get involved and why they need to get involved when they, when they are um, eligible? Yeah, it's a great program. Um, and every um, uh, family, because it can be a family application. It doesn't have to be a, a single student submitting an application, but every family has to uh, reapply for their benefits every year. Um, but it's if they re apply for benefits and they meet, it's, it's totally based on income and the number of people in their household. So based on that information, if they meet a certain economic standard, um, income standard, then they can uh, receive or be eligible for free meals or reduced reduced meals. In our district in particular, going back to financials, we even feed our reduced students for free as well because we're financially able to do that. And so if they, if they uh, are eligible for free or reduced price meals, they eat breakfast and lunch um, for free at the campus. Thank you again for joining us here on Rock Talk. More information on food services can be found at ronrockisd.org. Um, look at departments and for food services or under the parents menu or students menu on the Round Rock ISD website. Kelly and Bob, thank you so much for joining us. Our pleasure. Thank you again. And we'll see you next time on Rock Talk.